Hello everybody, this is Bean Air Technical Support. Today we're gonna tell you uh, how to do a port forward. Okay, so let me first explain the situation. We have here a wireless sensor network, we have a Bean Gateway, some Bean devices, and these are located on a site, for example, let's say a construction site, and connected to a 3G router. My objective is to supervise this WSN using Beanscape inside my office. Well, the problem, the problem is that I am using a different ADSL modem inside my office. So when I try to localize this Bean Gateway, I won't fi find it because I don't know on which IP address it is located. So here on the left side, I this is my laptop that I'm using uh, on the construction side to configure the uh, Binaire application. On the right side, I have my desktop PC, which is located inside my office in a remote control unit using TeamViewer. So first, I'll try, I'm gonna put myself here. I'm here on the site and connected to the 3G router, okay? Let's find out if we can see the Bing Gateway. Okay, here is our Bing Gateway. That's great. Start the server. And here I got my Bing Gateway. I can connect my uh, my Bing devices. Okay. Here I connected a AX three D X range. Okay. So my objective here is I want to supervise this WSN from my office. So I cannot just simply go and localize the Bing Gateway because I don't know on which IP address it is. Okay, so first I'll have to go to tools here, localize the Bing Gateway again. Here's my Bing Gateway, and I'll tell him that Beanscape is located on a different IP address. So I I'll have to know on which IP address this Beanscape is. What is the public IP address of my ADSL modem located in my office? So I have to just open a tab here and ask Google about my IP address. So my IP address is 197. 197 and 159. Second, as you can see here, we have a port which is 5313. I'm gonna create here on my office, of course. I'm gonna create a virtual server. Okay. Uh, I'll tell, tell uh, let's say, the modem to listen to this port. To listen to this port and direct direct it to my private IP address. So I'm gonna open a new tab on my browser. So I'll go to my modem here. Just have to write down these numbers: one nine two one six eight one and one. So here I have my modem, okay, I'll go to virtual server, okay, so I'll add the virtual server here, I'll name it for example Beanscape Forward, I'll have to know which is what is my private IP address? Okay, so I'll have to go start, open a command window.
write down IP config. So my private IP address is this one. So I have to write it down here. 192.168.1 and 48. Okay, I'll have to enter the external port start. 131. Yeah. The external port end and I can just rewrite the same number. Okay. And then apply. Now I have forwarded this port to this IP address. Okay, that's great. I'll have to val press validate here. So on this Beanscape, we have no more WSM displayed because we forwarded this to this one. And I can see, as you can see, it's not magic, it's port forwarding. Thank you very much for listening and have a good day.